Now, there's Experian. We monitor the dark web globally with alerts to help protect you from identity theft. And because we're Experian, our U.S.-based agents have the power to help you resolve issues quickly. Start free for 30 days at Experian.com slash protect. Identity protection has a new identity. Experian. Platoon. Each level in Platoon is different, so you'll have to master each one separately. You can't make it through this game without a map. Fast reflexes help, too. 
They can't hit you when you switch rooms. Watch out for trip wires. Here are the explosives. Believe it or not, you can jump over bullets. Get this box and you'll get an extra life. Leave explosives on the bridge. Don't shoot the villagers. Go to the third hut for a map of the tunnel system. Watch out for booby traps. Get a torch from the fifth hut. You'll need it underground. Then use the trap door to go down in the fourth hut. Go as fast as possible and follow the on-screen map. Take everything here, the flares and the documents. Take the medical supplies, flares and weapons, then exit. Follow the map. Take the secret documents and the compass. Go to the end of the tunnel, take the ammo, then go up the ladder. In this level, shoot every shadow before it becomes a person. Shoot them before they shoot you. You're fighting shadows here. Here's the fourth level. Use your compass and good luck. Let's entertain them. Uh, let's do this. And the challenge was, can I do it? Can I, can I give things to make these people happy? Because I just love them. I love, I love these people up here. I don't just take them for granted. I don't take these avatars. They're not just avatars. That's, that's people I know, and I love them. And I thought, can I really do it? And because nobody else was doing much about it. And I thought, can I really do it? Can I start giving things and really come, really have fun? And yep, I did. I started giving things. And let's have that dance type thing. You had to learn, we learned how to dance with these avatars and all this kind of stuff. They just, I mean, I just started, let's have a party. Let's do this tonight. Let's start playing music. Let's do this. And they helped me. And, but like I told you last night in a conversation that wasn't taped, I am only as good as the people that helped me. And I had lots of help. And I had some, I have good friends. I love those people. And they helped me. And they helped me. Anytime I give something, that it's a success because they helped me. But it was a challenge. Oh, yes, it was to start out something new and start out giving. That's, that's a challenge. That's a big challenge. And like I told you, soon I was considered, uh, they called, they referred to me as a calling card because they like, they, wherever I was, they thought, oh, there's going to be fun. They said, maybe there, oh, let's go there. She's going to think of something. And I had to think of something, and that's a challenge because I had to think of something to keep these people coming in and wanting to have more and fun. And it worked.
in an average week. The networks bring you six made-for-TV movies. Dull. 18 hours of sitcoms. Ditto. 35 hours of infomercials. Insane. 44 hours of soap operas. Very dull. 62 hours of reruns. I saw that. And 3.2 days of commercials. <laughs> now, it's payback time. Oh, what do you mean? You see, there are only three of them. You mean the networks? Yeah, the old-style networks, and they're fading away. But there are 30 million of us. Yeah, everyone with a camcorder and a VCR. And now we've got a powerful new weapon against blah, blah, blah vision. What's the new weapon? It's new software. Yeah. It's new hardware. Hey. It's the next generation of the most successful video tool of all time. A whole new video toaster. It'll be the end of blah, blah, blah television. <laughs> the Video Toaster 4000. Toaster 4000 takes the power away from the network and gives it to the people. With Toaster 4000, we can make television better than the networks, and we don't have to answer to anyone. I get so hungry. How can I lose weight? You can lose weight deliciously with the aid of AIDS. The AIDS diet plan really works. AIDS contains a safe and effective appetite suppressant when used as directed. Helps curb your appetite so you can lose weight. This salad is perfect. The plan lets you enjoy two AIDS before each meal. Delicious chocolate flavor. Mm. And AIDS does work. I see. Lose weight deliciously with the aid of AIDS. Attention shoppers from department stores to off-price outlets. This week, find out where the bargains really are. How buyers make deals that affect your wallet. And does it pay to shop by mail? It won't cost you a dime to shop around on Good Morning America this week. An ABC News brief. Now from Washington, Tom Gerald. Good evening. In Beirut, a previously unknown terrorist group announced it will free American hostage Frank Reed within 48 hours and said he'll be carrying a message for President Bush. Most of Bush refused to speculate on the announcement but said if it proves true, it's wonderful. The 57-year-old Reed, who was director of the Lebanese International School in Beirut, was kidnapped in September 1986. That's News Brief. More later on the ABC News Weekend Report. After a mix-up at the hospital, Detective Bert Simpson thinks he's got two weeks to live. What's the difference if it happens, it happens. But if he can go in the line of duty, All right. his family will be set for life. Never for but getting killed isn't as easy as it looks. Short time. You miss me again, you idiot. Rated PG-13. Starts Friday at a theater near you. Check newspapers for showtime. It's a major price reduction of the entire Dodge inventory at Dodge Country San Jose. It's the deal of the decade, only at the regional Dodge outlets. Guaranteed factory invoice pricing on Dodge cars and trucks. And get guaranteed rebates up to $2,000. Get a new Dodge Caravan for $11,888, just $1.99 a month. That's a brand new Dodge Caravan for $11,888, just $1.99 a month. The deal of the decade is here now. Only at the regional Dodge outlet, Dodge Country San Jose. Let's take a look at some of the PSP titles that are scheduled for release later on in the year.
PlayStation Portable, ladies and gentlemen. Oh boy, I am late. Sorry about that, guys. So, I was eating. I was cramming food in my face. And then, wouldn't you know it, Alain Noir did not fire right up. But I just had to tab in and out a couple times. 2017, almost a year. Probably the exact same place. But we're back. We're back. Popping drinks. Is that what you're playing right now? What? Yeah, Alain Noir? Mm hmm It is very good. Shit. Thank you, Rickle. Hold up for a second. When I pop that soda, some soda got on my monitor. I gotta clean that. One minute. Play you guys to the game zone. Actually, no, sorry, I'll just I'll just throw on videos. God damn it. I'll be back, I promise. Okay, monitor's clean. Yeah, there's O2 key. There's no Mountain Dew spray on my monitor. No rage spittle from yelling at yelling at Quake. New desk, kid. We're on traffic. The hot sheet is posted here next to the map. Wait, I saw this. You can't skip it. That's Biggs. He's an institution. So this is what all the fuss. Thanks for the reset, millennial. Why couldn't they build a freeway that goes Thanks for the resub caps. I even approved the money yet. Appreciate all that. The bond issue won't be. I, uh, no, you can't skip. Austin, I'm really enjoying Dragon Quest XI too. Stefan Burkowski. I mean, it's it's Dragon Quest up and down and left and right in every other way, but it's great. I enjoy. Here to learn, detective. I'll just skip this prime story because I saw it last time, Craig. I don't know when the checkpoints land. Mint a detective here, Cole Phelps. This guy with Hi, fucking Phelps. salmon sleeves. Oh, eye on you. Tweed body. A little time basking in reflected glory. Make a change from busting hookers and dope feet. Millennius. Millennius. Roy Earl, chief detective and Thank you for the prime sub. Like what am I drinking? Well, Roy is a movie. Star. Dr Pepper Ten. The whole of the seedy side of LA. My gamer fuel. <laughs> Great pairing with Everclear. FYI. Stick with me, kid. You'll find out. I I always thought Dr. Pepper has kind of a grape flavor profile. So I want to experiment with Dr. Pepper, fruit juice, and booze. Or maybe Dr. Pepper and like Diet Slice, Diet Sunkist. Um, you guys may know Phelps. He's the cop who broke the jewelry store murder. I don't really do that anymore. If it's all right with you, sir. Stand the fuck up. Shh, shh, quiet. 
What's up, Jessica? Is one of only two serving LAPD officers hello, hello. who received the Silver Star during the war. You really gave it those lousy Japanese, eh, Phelps? Dr. Pepper and Grape Crush? Captain, why are you war heroes? I typically use diet sodas as a mixer because it just amounts to soda water. Everybody's favorite pole, Stefan Bukowski. <laughs> I want to, uh... Bukowski sure is all done. Achieve good flavor in a way that... Fuck, Melanius, thank you. I don't get to support you in the house enough? If you watch our content, dude, that's enough. You don't have to do that. But thank you for the cheer regardless. I'm gonna start you out with one case. You okay? I'll give you a couple an idiotic shot. Two ounces of 151. Chase with water. Optional. License plates. Now get down to the PE freight. Yeah. Sixth and Alameda. That's pretty... called in a suspicion. When are you gonna be able to talk about the new Hitman stuff? That was in, uh... Come on, fellas. We'll be in Gaming Weekly. Because the embargo was tomorrow morning. So you'll, you'll hear about it from everyone tomorrow morning. All right. Do you think this crack and rum and Dr. Pepper is the best mixed drink? I could see that. They're both kind of like they really push spicy and fruity. Six years on patrol before I got this desk. You were here in five minutes. What do you want me to say? I didn't ask for any favors. Hey, Jacob. How was set up today? What do you mean set up for the for the show? Omar did it all. You'd have to ask him. I, he's probably still at work, too, which I feel really bad about. I feel like it's a failure of planning on my part if he has to work late. Hey, you're still playing on keyboard? Yeah, the controller's still not working, and I didn't... Near the old gas works and signal I did not uh, spend a lot of time troubleshooting it. I'll direct. Gonna be playing Black Ops 4? Probably. I had a lot of fun with Blackout. Wait, what is it called? That's it, right? So, tell me a little about yourself, Phelps. Are we friends now, Bukowski? We have to work together. Don't be so touchy. Grew up in San Francisco. I hit the button. Never... My father was in shipping. Went to college in Stanford. Did two years ROTC before... Come on, I gotta do optional shit, right? Blackout. Okay, I thought so. Out in early 45. Part of my brain was like, you're making that up. And I was like, well, the OP novel came Caught me by surprise. I was wounded. Took back home. Did a year on the beat. I thought there was going to be more space. But yeah, I, um, zombies is always a little confusing, a little dense, but I'm kind of hoping that uh, it's approachable and that I can get people to play with me. No, you were up there all night, draped in the flag. Nice to put you gun at the ready. You finished? The Emperor, Hirohito himself. No, he's not finished. To charge against you. I did my part, Mikowski. What did you do? I kept the streets of LA safe with people. Yeah. Now I get it. All units of 459 just occurred at 6th and Saras. Any unit to handle, code 2, identified. 11K, go ahead, KGPO. 11K, a 459 suspect just left 6th and Saras. Suspect is. Up on the roof, officer. He has a mask on his face. I caught sight when he shoved past me. Yeah, Call of Duty is a fortnight now. Gun. He's wearing a bandit mask? Are you serious? Reminded you of Mafia, which you liked way better. Different kinds of games, though. Yeah, I'm not... I, I enjoyed the beginning of Mafia 3, but I just kind of fell out of it. People say Mafia 2 is super good. I used to own it on, like, I bought it used at a Babbage's or something. I had it for a long time, I just never got around to playing it. I'm pretty sure, yeah, Jess, Jess will yell at me for not having played. No? Okay. Somebody said last time if you just aim a gun at somebody, they'll, like, get intimidated or you'll fire a warning shot. Oh, just a warning shot? Alright. Oh, he's still going. Here's your ass. Ah. Come on, Flatfoot. Let's negotiate. Put the weapon down now. Capacitate. On your own goddamn head, be it. Oh shit. Ah. 
thought it would hit his arm. That did not go well. You got to lock on. I don't know what lock on is. This mouse and keyboard. They never told me that. Okay, let me. I might need to know what that is then. Oh boy. Mm. I'm I'm still I'm gonna take back some of the things I said about Rockstar's PC ports. The ones that I've played have been great. This one is not. But it functions. I guess it deserves credit for running, you know. Eight years after the fact. Grapple. Enter exit cover. Change your camera. Is it X? Oh party hold on. Practice Chopra. Hello. It's gonna be the switch port. It did. I don't know how it is. I, don't play it. I probably would have gotten it on Switch, but I was always like, oh, I want to play it, and I already own it on PC. I can't. I shouldn't buy games twice. Up on the roof, officer. He has a Only on chases when the person is not hostile, just running away. When he mm, shoved past okay. me, but be careful. I saw him waving a gun. You aim at them and keep aiming at them. It's not locked on. You have to keep aiming. You have to aim and keep aiming. Can you still be running, or do you have to stand still? I'll figure it out. Circle will fill up around the reticle. Make it easy on yourself. Get the hell away from me. Pretty sure there's nudity. That's that's not explicitly banned on Twitch. Um. But yeah, also no spoilers. I keep forgetting to put that in the. Uh, Oh, people said you couldn't do that. Okay. Uh, what was I gonna say? Oh yeah, I really should have put it in the title. That I'm doing this blind. That's the etiquette, right? You put blind, and then people don't theoretically don't spoil the game for you. Fuck, dude. That was crazy. Oh God, I can't take this. Help, he has a gun. He's dead? Uh. Case closed. Okay. Is it just me or does it seem like Smash is mainly getting indies and deluxes? Oh, you mean Switch? Yeah, I don't think that's a bad thing. I think it fills a great niche in games. I think it's like what the Wii was trying to be. A kind of a kind of mid-tier haven for less than AAA games. So like all of all of the mid-tier Steam stuff. The in like five person games that are Go on through. Still solid. Parking lot straight ahead. Okay, the nephew says hi. Well, hello, Kate. Uh, yeah, I got him in the femoral. Get back to work, officer. The detectives are here now. You repeat to them what you told me. I did the right thing by calling this in. I'm just a working stick. Just give him your story and you'll be all right. I don't know about that. Lighting around Lawrence makes it look like he's on low HP. I meant it to look like black and white and moody. So hopefully something about that this is your working. first case, Phelps. Stop oscillating. Sums. You don't know what to do next. Just come talk to me, and we'll see what we can figure. Out. Thanks, Stefan. Oh, it was very You're okay. I was very, uh, very supportive of him. Things are about to get racist. Yeah, welcome to the forties. Where's this fifties? Imagine taking Ellie Noir on the go in public. I mean, there's there's titties on Switch. I've seen him. I'm Officer Hart. Phelps, traffic. I think a Yowie game is getting published? 47, okay. I thought it was late 40s. Stolen. Thank you. The solid citizen is Nate Wilkie. He called it in. What gives with the corner? There's blood all over the interior. 
Someone's copped the full Broderick, but no stiff as yet. We have an owner for the car? The car is registered to an Adrian Black, just north of Bunker Hill. All right, we'll take a look around. I'll keep Mr. Wilkie talking, but don't make him wait too long. He's the restless type. Just don't think Rockstar is or will make a bully suit. Uh, nice day for it. Hard to say. I don't think so. Doc? Detective? Maybe? What have we got? A lot of blood for a blunt force injury. The victim must be in a very bad way. Any sign of the guy? Not unless he's in the trunk of the car. Well, you pointed directly there. Hmm. Hmm. Mr. F. Morgan picked up a live pig yesterday? Suspicious. Press X. Can't. Probably nothing. Yeah, I guess it's normal for a lug wrench to be in a be in a trunk. Have you got a wide shot of the car and its surrounds? Listen, I've never met, so I'm just gonna go ahead and say this once. You don't tell me how to do my job, and I won't tell you how to do yours. Fair. Ugh. Victim looks to have lost a lot of blood. Very astute, Cole. Uh, I guess this is just trash. It's just trash. What else we got? Any other clues? Is that somebody put that there? Somebody put that there. How's the engine looking? Can't look at it. All right. What happened to the detective? I don't know. Uh, game. I think I. So this is this is not reliable, but I remember James saying something to the effect of he felt like there were no more jokes to make. So it was just him running into stuff and being wrong. Name's Nick. I, I, you found the vehicle? Sure. Uh, so I'm not sure. I think he just got tired of making it. Figured I'd better take a look. I think. And then I saw all the blood, so I called the police. Do you know Adrian Black, Mr. Wilkie? No, sir. That ain't a name I- It looks so patronizing for some reason. Adrian Black, Mr. Wilkie. You ever seen the car before? Funny enough, I did. A couple of nights ago, it was over there in the parking lot. Thought it got repetitive? I know most of the cars are parked. There you go. So it kind of stood out. Mind if I ask what you were doing out here? Well, I work for the railway. I was on my way out to the switch and reckoned I'd take a shortcut. He's... Did you see anybody else in the yard? Maybe somebody hanging around the car? Nope. I hadn't seen a soul all day till you boys turned up. This guy seems like a straight shooter. All right. Thank you for your patience, Mr. Wilkie. If you've been waiting a little longer, I'm sure we'll have more questions once we've had a look around. What, is the, what does the rank do? I'm sure I'll, I'll figure it out. Isn't the doubt always super aggressive? I mean, probably. You didn't have a reason to not be aggressive. Like, what's the, what's the consequence? You'll just piss someone off? I mean, that's a lot of fucking blood. Shit. Oh. Uh, I thought they ended because they lost progress and had to restart it. I mean, you could be right, Austin. I, I said I was, uh, just guessing, uh, based on very, very distant and fuzzy memories. Stenzel glasses. Home repaired, by the look of it. Those look nice. I know the moment has passed, but I feel like I look good in glasses like that. The, the fashion has moved on. Right. Happier times, I guess. Faked his own death, kind of thing? Because his wife is leaving him? Thirty-two years old, married. Sounds like an average guy. What was he doing out here? 
That license looks real cool, by the way. Yeah, there are no movements, that's for sure. Alright, well... I guess we take the car. Get in the car! I don't guess I can ask him about... Oh! I mean, he probably doesn't know oh, shit about it. Was there anything in it when you arrived? Yeah, no spoilers, please. I mean, he looks... Oh! Oh! He's smugging up, but I, I have... So you always said I could lie and then back out. Tell the truth, Mr. Wilkie. You rifled the wallet. My money is my money. You can't prove I touched that wallet. Oh, he, mm, he said. I mean, I don't. How long are you gonna keep me here, sir? Are those glasses his? Because I have n none of this really does anything. You're off the hook, for now. Here, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it. Five hidden vehicles. Ninety-nine point two. After choosing any. So wait, if. If you don't, if you do have the evidence to prove it, if not, go with doubt. Oh, okay. Okay, right. I forgot that was the logic. You're right. Do you want the patrolman to hold you down while we turn out your pockets, Mr. Wilkie? Maybe I checked inside that wallet. Not that I was going to steal anything. Maybe I took a look. But there weren't no money in there. Not even chain. Oh, okay. That didn't actually get me anything. Does... Um, the blackout tonight? Uh, is it out? I thought it. I thought it came out like at midnight. That sound means a clue, right? Schwung. Did I miss something? Just went live on my screen. Oh, all right. There's nothing else to look at. Yeah, okay. Maybe there's something else about the glasses? Maybe they're his glass? No? He already admitted to doing it, so I'm not gonna get anything out of going down that road. It's weird that, like, he admitted to rifling through it, and then we're just like, well, I guess if you said there was nothing in it, you're probably gonna, not gonna lie about that. What were you looking at? What is this? Oh, trash. Not much help. So, oh shit, there's another thing over here. One second, guys. I actually have, like, a window in the way, so I'm gonna tab out real quick. Higher rank, more intuition points it gives you? That makes sense. Although, the uh, thing it said to get more intuition wasn't levels, or rank, it was finding five hidden vehicles. Okay, now I can see all the chat. Okay, so we've bashed a pig with a pipe brand name might give us something to go on yeah do you think think talk is you guys take your time no nice. freight rolling through here till we're done and we're still punching the clock <laughs> I appreciate that So I can ask him about a pipe. We found a steel pipe with blood on it near the car. You know anything about it, Mr. Wilkie? No, sir. I went straight for the law when I saw the car was full of blood. Well, you also... Yeah, he's, he's dead-eyeing me. When you saw the blood, was it wet, bright red, or uh, darker like it is There's now? several ways to get points. Uh, darker, cool. I'd say. Looked dry already. Thank you for your help, Mr. Wilkie. All right. We'll contact your employer if we need Feels good. Help. If you have to. And that's a guess. tutorial thing was. I can't really spend no more time over this. Reward is five hidden vehicles. What does that mean? You're done here. We'll head over there now. So wait a minute. Oh, okay.
BitKing has a good question. Awful millennial, is your name that you're just bad at being a millennial? Or is it like a millennial that old people hate? Because you killed the napkin industry. Oh, okay, the kind that old folks hate. Smart, I love it. Embrace it. Also, fuck old people. You know where that is? Man. Behind Bunker Hill. A couple blocks north of Central Station. So, what do we tell them? I've often wondered if... Like, I have the capacity to just get old and hateful. And the people that are old and hateful always fucking condescendingly tell you that you do. Oh, you'll see. You just wait. You'll be old and racist, too. I don't think I will. But why leave the car? Well, obviously, someone got a little heavy hand. It's the wrong way around. Well, how so, genius? Sorry. Don't worry about it. We got an understanding. I really wanted to hear what they were talking about. How so, genius? Thank you. Where is Adrian? If you've gone to all the trouble to steal the car and it goes wrong, you leave the body behind, not the car. We got something that comes. Doesn't add up. Fake his own death with a fake pig. Or a live pig. What's happening right now with my generation yelling about Fortnite? What are they saying? Fortnite was ruined by the babies? No, what happened? Over on Lincoln Avenue. This guy's driving along and his oil light comes on. He stops the car and gets out. He pops the hood and he's on a rail crossing. Oh, <laughs> you got it. He got his head under there checking the oil, and the Southern Pacific freight slams into his car doing 90 miles an hour. The car came to a rest more than a mile down the track. Mm. What a point. Oh shit, Pershing Square? Seriously? Cool. Wait. Get plenty of blood and guts and mindless stupidity work in traffic. It doesn't look like that now. And who needs a second amendment when we'll give a goddamn fool the license to get behind the wheel of an automobile? That's a great question. Oh shit, there's a sub. Bit King. Thank you for subbing. Complaining about Gen Z and their damn dancing. Really? That's it? I remember hearing some people talk about how, like, Fortnite had changed because, uh, once it went mobile, there were girls playing it now. Ew. Gross. Ooh. Zomcon, thank you for the resub. As usual, females getting everywhere. Okay, got a track. For you, Bit King. This is from a. I guess this is Vaporwave as shit. And it came out in 2014, and I'm kicking myself because I only just recently listened to it, but please enjoy this track. The album is actually really cool because most tracks are about a minute long and it's just like a couple of really good kind of synthwave loops. Uh, do, a, do ASMR with titty out? That's where the real money is? I'd have to be on a different service. Guys can't be shirtless, right? Why leave the victim's ID? If it's a murder, why leave the car? The evidence doesn't add up. Free lesson, folks. Evidence will only get you so far. You ask me, the whole thing feels hinky as hell. What I would give to have your powers of intuition, Don't worry, kid. Keep watching the master and you'll get there one day. 
Sarno, thanks for resubbing. Oh yeah, Carmel Dancing. That's a solid tune. Solid dance. But yeah, I guess that makes sense though. A generation of, of memes is now getting old enough to realize their memes are gone. And you're realizing that like memes aren't special. You're realizing that every generation makes their own and that yours were just another in a long series of people doing that shit. Hurts. That hurts. Oops. It, uh... Every time that happens, you get a little wiser, though. When you realize something that you thought was just yours is actually part of a human experience that is vast and deep and wide and beautiful. Fuck! What the fuck? Party left K. We'll handle the health call. Go ahead, KBG. Jesus Christ! Whatever. Perfect stop. Jesus Christ! Why is that so loud? These guns are loud. Something seems wrong about that. I see you, motherfuckers. Come on up here and get us. What is all this? Traffic stop from hell. Oh shit! Crowley pulls these guys over. Finds a trunk full of hardware like you can They lose it. Bullets start flying, and they snatch up the guns in one of the cops. Head to high ground. And and the officer up there. Christ. Still alive, we think. Who knows for how long? We'll keep him busy if you can find a way up, sir. Fuck. Well, there's a pipe right next to that dude, but that doesn't seem right. Jesus Christ. Leave cover. Leave cover. There you go. My hat! Okay, well. Uh, I don't know what snapped cover is. Because it's not what it is in... Not what it is in GTA. Tears, that is my favorite. Oh, I can see this every time? Yeah. I see you motherfuckers. Come on up here and get us. What is all this? Crowley and pulls these guys over. Finds a trunk full of hardware that we wouldn't do. They lose. Bullets start flying. And they snatch up the guns and one of the cops. Head to high ground. And the officer? Up there. Still alive, we think. I don't know for how long. We'll keep you busy if you can find a way up, sir. If people are shooting at you, there's no reason to not shoot them dead, right? Subdue the armed suspects. Yeah. There's never a time when you can, when you can just like subdue somebody, kind of like it says. Control and use. All right. So what is cover? Oh, what was? How do you get into cover? Oh boy. Partner run. Control. Thought I was hitting that. Okay, I guess you gotta hold it. Yeah, it was left control, you were right. No, 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 no. Right. God, it yanks the aim whenever you pop out from cover. It's Where? kind of ridiculous. Subdue so just means make them stop whatever they're doing. Yeah, okay. Look at all those bullet holes. That's awesome. You deal with him. I'll cover the from here. Oh, on, thanks. Thanks, buddy. 
Luckily, my suit has... The bullet holes have, have healed. My self-healing suit is kicking in. I'll pick up your hat by walking into it, yeah. Put the weapon down, now! I'll get it later. That was unwise. I can't wait to watch all those cutscenes again. Oh well, it's pretty easy. I mean, if if you don't overthink it, shoot everybody. I see you, motherfuckers. Come on up here and get us. Dude, face his head a foot to the left the second you fire. To be fair, uh, pulls these guys eh. I ain't gonna sweat it. Winners don't make excuses. The officer up there, still alive. We think. Who knows for how long? Keep him busy, keep him find a way up there. Not dead? Today. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. All right. Well, I will remain hatless. This dude is still up. Jeez. You got a good point. You got a good point, millennial. When people were real Republicans in the '40s, they could get shot eight times and not die. And now all these weak-ass children with their memes and their Fortnites. Go on, get up there. They can't even get through a school day without getting shot. Put the weapon Snowflakes. Down. Somebody said the leg. Jesus. Got him. 11K. I've been involved in a shooting. It's code four here, but suspect- A shooting? And I need an ambulance in Chateau and Valencia. Also notify detective headquarters. I'll need the coroner. My partner and I are okay. 11K, Roger on the ambulance and coroner. Detective headquarters will be notified. All units, 11K reports. Code four on the shooting. All right. Just murdered three dudes. No paperwork to do. Back in the car. Let's go. Just shake all the bullets out of the out of the bullet holes and plug it up with pipe tobacco. God damn maniac! Call it in. Were the Dems and Republicans opposite of current times until like the eighties? Yeah. I remember reading that in history class a long time ago. I don't remember the specifics, though. I do remember at some point they inverted. And when it comes to, like, liberal and conservatism, I don't even know what it means now. It just means, like... If you could turn America into a religion, that's what the Republican Party is now. It's gone, it's gone full bonkers as opposed to just being partial bonkers. What do you think of DMC5 so far? I haven't, I haven't played it. I'm glad they're making it. I haven't really followed anything about it. I need to look into it. Uh, please throw on the siren. Ah, uh, it sounds it sounds caustic. I don't want to inconvenience anyone. I'll just run into them. Really? Boy, they're really sprinkling these things in. If you don't do one the first time it comes up, will it will it? Spawn later? Got a siren for a reason. Shut up! No backseat driving. 
No, you're the one who's wrong, I say as I ram into a streetlight. You just get in the general area of it? Oh, okay. Well, now you've either got to stop or put your fucking foot down. That was close. I'm sure he's fine. This is really far away. I'm not good at driving. Waz is a real son of a bitch. Don't blame it on that. Holy shit! I guess they have traffic laws for a reason. Oh my god! Alright. I gotta... Do not run into my car, bro! Alright. Alright, we're doing it. People freaking me out. Finally, starting to think nobody would show. Gang fight, awesome. We got the Third Street Gang and the Diamond Street Gang. Mexican kids with nothing better to do than howl at each other, but no bloodshed so far. Ooh. Hope you brought plenty of ammunition, sir. This is an achievement for doing 20 grand in damages. Drop your weapon. Got a goddamn machine gun? What? Oh, my bro's down. How long do you think you can hold out? Whoa! God, this music is the greatest. No, 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 no! Hold control. It's not working. What? Instead, I stood up. All right. You ever run out of ammo? I'm guessing no. My hat. I think the vibe's worth it. It's really cool, but it's very expensive. It's it's so hard to say. If you're bored with video games and you have a lot of money, go for it. It can also be a little difficult to set up. If you're used to like massaging PCs into functionality, you'll be fine. But if you don't have patience for that, I wouldn't recommend it. Can you just take cars? Is that a thing you can just do? You can. Ma'am, I'm sorry. Please. Please. Oh, suicide doors? Hell yeah! Oh, okay. Okay, there are- there is a vehicle unlocking thing. Oh man, that's not good. Whenever you do a mission, does it, uh, spawn a police car for you? Yeah. Idiot Detective Not Catch On. This game's so goofy. It was a good series. Um, some people have asked that. I don't know. I, n I was never the one producing it. Um, somebody in chat remembered that, I guess, it was discussed on a post-show that the save was corrupted for it, and they didn't want to play through the whole thing again. I hope you get the death penalty. Jesus, man. I'm a cop. Anyway. Uh, I, can, I can understand not wanting to play through this game again since you can't skip the cutscenes. I guess you can skip the tutorial, so there's that. But there's something special today. I saw two to three more streamers playing Alien Noir. No? Uh, if, if only that... What I would bet is kind of similar to what I'm doing. It's like, Red Dead 2's in the news. It's making you think about Rockstar. I'm guessing just more Rockstar games are getting streamed. Probably more people playing the original Red Dead. And stuff like that. That's what I would guess. Excited for DMC5? I am. Very excited for it. Like I said before, I haven't followed it much. I watched the trailer. Some of the trailers. I don't know, like, all the all the gameplay specifics or anything. Jesus. I'm too good to stop at a light. Move. I'm out of here. Bro. You ran the worst possible way. I wouldn't feel safe in a tank with you driving. I got a purple heart or whatever. Ready to PC win. Claw. If it follows GTA V's model, 
it's going to be around the time Red Dead 2 comes out on the next generation of consoles, PS5 or Xbox Scarlet or whatever that is. So, two years, if that, I could see Red Dead never coming out on PC. I think it depends entirely what Red Dead Online looks like. How it works, how many users it gets. You gonna pick up Mega Man 11? I already, I already beat that game. I streamed the whole thing. So, yes? The, the flag moves on the map. Oh, Luminanti, I'm glad you liked it. Yeah, I'm looking forward to how that goes over on YouTube. I think it was too long. I feel bad about that. Oh, jeez. Time to flex my interviewing might. Just a minute! What's going on? LAPD, Mrs. Black. May we come in? We have some bad news, and we'd rather discuss this in private. I'm Margaret Black. Oh, we can discuss this in the living room. Please come in. Why does she already look sorrowful? She shouldn't know. Your husband drives a blue Lincoln, Mrs. Black? That's correct. The car has been found abandoned. And I'm afraid there are signs of foul play. I knew something was wrong when he didn't come home. We believe your husband may be injured. We found a pipe on the scene with blood on it. Oh, no! My poor Adrian! Does the name Instaheat mean anything to you, ma'am? Yes, it does. We've just had a new water heater installed. Hmm. Whereabouts, Mrs. Black? Just outside the kitchen window. At the side of the house. Outside? I'd like to stay calm and remember everything that you can about I last guess that night. makes sense. My partner and I are going to take a look around. When you're ready, we're going to have some more questions for you. Is that okay? Of course, officer. Anything to help secure my husband's safety. Well, let's check the place out. Come on. I'm going to read this magazine. Oh, fine. Have a good look around. There's got to be something in here to go on. Foot of her by herself? Seems odd. They repeat the water heater puzzle more than once in this game? Neat. Can't wait for some quality puzzling. It's like a life insurance scam or something? Solid pooch. Oh, a conspicuous slip of paper. Rail ticket. Seattle. A used ticket to Seattle and a suitcase gone missing. Someone couldn't wait to get out of this house. Hmm. Hmm. Well. Separate photos. Separate bedrooms. Separate pictures. What gives here? The glasses. Yes. This must be Adrian's. Those are his glasses. Stenzel. So the glasses are a match. It's just the same brand, but whatever, man. I'll take that. Okay. He's definitely wearing the glasses. So he was cheating on his wife with someone in Seattle? Faked his death. Like they had a loveless marriage, I'm guessing. Couldn't get divorced. She wanted him out. Kavanaugh's? So who brought this home? Maybe Adrian was a patron. R and I should have an address. Do I have a telephone? Or... Okay. I saw the phone in. 
Yeah, I guess I'll call it in right now. Why not? Why not? Operator, message for KGPL. <laughs> Wanted to run away with the pig, but they got in a wreck. Phelps, bad he was bull. so heartbroken with the loss of his pig, he had to start over, start fresh. I need an address on a Kavanaugh's bar. Look with your special eyes. Detective, one moment. Kavanaugh's bar, corner of Aliso and Hewitt, south side of Union Station. Thanks. Man, do you get to go to Union Station in this game? Because I'm into that. I am into that. Union Station is beautiful. This was only recently installed, not two days ago. I am Ryan. Maybe it's time we took a look around outside. God, how shitty that is. Okay. Oh, Nero has moves from Marvel? Is that what you're saying? More matchbooks. This whole game reminds me of Chinatown. I actually haven't seen that yet. Which is a shame. Like, a shameful. I live in, uh, I live in Los Angeles. There's no reason... Oh my gosh, what? Lie down, make yourself comfortable. So, you're a friend of Courtney's? Yes, Doctor. He seems very concerned. How old do you know the streets of LA? Like, if you got an address in this game, could you find your way there? Blinding visions. More or less, yeah. I can't get them out of my head. If you told me to find a street, I, if it's a main street, I could do it pretty well, I think. I want to give you something to calm your nerves. Um, an intersection. If it's a main intersection, I could do it. Downtown would be easy because downtown's not the bit the biggest. Especially if I have a car, I can just drive one way, and if I hit the edge of town, I'll turn around and come back. And LA's kind of a grid, so I wouldn't go right there. But I feel like I could find my way. I definitely know, like I can tell what part of LA I'm in by just how it looks. His face. A little wobbly. Interesting. Okay, so yeah, let's collect the collection. All right, let's go check out this water heater. He's talking about pizzas. Interesting. No use leaving the thing half finished. I have to, I have to fix the water heater. What? What do you want about? Boop. This is an odd, odd mini game. I can't be right. Gold, darn it! Why am I fixing this lady's water heater? What is happening? Oh, it's just so you can see that there's that piece missing? So the pipe missing from Mr. Black's heater is the same one that killed him. I feel like it wasn't necessary to do that. Looks like the assailant is a little closer to home. Let's <laughs> see if anything's missing. Duh. Yeah, fair. Did they repeat this puzzle more than once? I don't mind it. I'll take a dumb puzzle here and there. I like I like puzzles. I like the implication that routinely in your day you have to solve a like pat like a pattern or shape matching puzzle. Like for some reason the the vending machine at lunch is broken and you have to like put the batteries back in, but they're all weird shapes and you have to make them all fit. I'm all right. No. Oh gosh, okay. Does the order in which you ask questions matter? 
Because I feel like I should start general and then get, get more narrow and see what I can suss out. Maybe that's not the way you do it, but... I'm gonna do it that way. Did your husband tell you where he was going last night? All he said was he was gonna meet Frank for a drink. Frank. Looks truthful to me. Nothing out of the usual then. Well, he came home early from work. He never comes home early. And he went out early too. He normally never leaves for the bar till about seven. He comes home every night and leaves the bar at seven. So he's a, he's home for like thirty minutes and then he pieces out until the sun goes down, until like two a.m. You guys don't have the best marriage, I'm guessing. Marriage or whatever the heck this was. Please hurry! My husband might yeah. be injured. Husband. I have no reason to suspect her yet, but might as well ask where she was. I think you should come clean with us, Mrs. Black. Didn't mean that. Your husband is missing, and after our search, I'm willing to call the circumstances suspicious. Come on. Thank you for your movements last night. One. You're not accusing me. Wasn't what I. What I wasn't where I was going with that. Thing to say. Nope. Nope. Just wanted to know what you were up to. That's all. Waiting for Adrian to come home. That looks like truth to me. Is there anyone who can vouch for Dude, that? Dude, leave, leave it alone. Well, no. I, I was here alone. I cooked Adrian's dinner and waited. But he never came home. <laughs> Take her away, boys. We can shut this case. She does appear to be genuinely grieving. Uh, let's see. I guess this is the bar he went to a lot. Frequents Kavanaugh's bar. How did you know that? Adrian practically lives there after work. I have three intuition points? I... So Adrian spends a lot of time there. Up until recently, he's been away in Seattle a lot on business. Okay, so he's just, he faked his death to leave his wife. That's it. He's just a piece of shit. Was your husband wearing his glasses when he left here yesterday? Yes, he just bought a new pair. Oh, so he can leave the ones behind and still take his actual glasses. Go on. <laughs> Doubt. Two. He tried to repair them with tape. It looked terrible. <sighs> Alright. I... She doesn't know shit. Somebody at the bar probably will because he'll get drunk and blab about it. Alright. Is there any reason in this game to withhold information from people? So, like... I... Presuming that, I mean, I'll, I'll finish the investigation, but like, if it were me, I'd be like, okay, let's go talk to the people at the bar before I let her know that her husband's cheated on her. Like, I feel like, no, it, isn't it like cruel to let someone mourn the memory of somebody they thought was great instead of being like, hey, your husband was a piece of shit, you should move on. Don't schmuck this up. Yeah, you're right. Doesn't get that complicated. Okay. We found a receipt. In the trunk that is some emotional subtlety I don't expect a game would care about. The receipt was made out to an F. Morgan. A pig? Adrian runs a tool business. That would be Frank Morgan. God knows what he's up to. What makes you say that about Morgan, ma'am? He's the foreman at my husband's plant. A very shady character. I told Adrian he needs to keep his distance from the staff. Their eyes out drinking together. Alright, put it in his name so that it wasn't a direct connection. That's pretty easy. Well, I'm sorry, but... Tell us about the photo of Adrian in the bedroom. What is there to tell? It's from his most recent business trip to Seattle. Oh, sweetie. What was the purpose of Adrian's trip to Seattle, Mrs. Black? He was meeting with some distributors. Adrian said that it was important to make contact interstate if he was going to grow his business. Oh, he made contact, all right, and he grew. 
What His business. Okay. Please do detect Outfits? Five out of six. Huh. Which one? I wonder which one I should have doubted or whatever. Was there a lie? Curious. Curious. Oh, okay, so there is just a cop car chilling outside. Music cues. The last one, she she knew he had a mistress. Oh, okay. Ah, I wasn't paying that close of attention. Emergency call. I need to take this. She knew? Okay. I guess I, I was, like, so used to seeing her true face. Mr. and Mrs. Black don't seem to have the happiest home life. He's too scared to divorce her, and she's too much of a shrinking violet to throw him out. If this hadn't happened, they could have stayed miserable together forever. You think she could have killed him? She sure as hell doesn't seem the type. But stranger things have happened. God damn. Playing through Arkham Knight? I like it a lot. I liked it a lot. It did, I think, have hit the critical mass of stuff that they could cram into that game, but it was very good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think the tunnel's still there. That's the Broadway. Noise. When the music sounds fucked, you got an answer wrong. Okay. You have to stay near it to get that cinematic view. Also, I forgot the tool tip already. Where do you go to change your outfit? This is 11K. Go ahead with the further. Hey, Angel's Flight. They finally reopened that. So long. They're getting away. What happened here, sir? Oh, it's just the options. Okay. They, they had guns. Dirty louses took everything and then booked. They went that way. The, the, the stairs alongside the track. This music is all right, though. You look like a rat with a gold tooth in the box. LAPD. Taking a run time to duck. Stop it, pal. Price. Take the train thingy, it's very slow. So you just have to fucking gun them down? There's so much of this game, I think they expect you to just blow people away as soon as you can. Sure, first ask later. Yeah, I'm kind of, I'm kind of understanding. A uh, sneak up, maybe. I can try. Yeah. What took you so long? They're getting away. What happened here, sir? They, These are street cases. Yeah, welcome to America. Glasses took everything yeah. and then booked. They went that way. The, the, the stairs alongside the track. Did people say booked in the '40s? I always thought that was relatively new slang. They're shooting the leg. Yeah, I mean, I did before and the guy died immediately. Alright. Nope, they scatter. Just gotta turn his leg into gravy. Shoot it 18 times. Car 11K. Shots fired. The suspect is down at 3rd and Hill. It's code 4. A lot of slang we use nowadays origin originated in 40s and 50s teen culture. That's it? Alright, we're good. Also, Flapper Queen, I, uh, I appreciate your username in conjunction with that. I know flappers were more of a 20s thing, but still. I feel like I should mix it up. Get some different cars. I'm gonna play swing, swing, swing. LAPD, police emergency. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, it was another car. Damn it. Oh, no, it's still this one. Excellent.
barely hear it. I guess it's pretty accurate in that way. I had a car from the 70s and you could barely hear the radio over the engine. God, imagine how shitty that radio must have sounded. Garbage ass speakers from the 40s. Shitty reception. Bad recording technology. It's mostly coming through. Fourteen forty or the one hundred forty four P radio, three G of radio, solar calculator radio, Nokia eighty one hundred radio, or whatever the number was on. I was sitting down with my grand grandfather to watch me play this game, and first of all, he loved how it looked, but the second thing he wanted me to do is go around and drive all the cars he left from his childhood. That's fan That's that's really charming. I wonder what that is going to be like when we're old, you know? There's some VR thing that lets you live in 2010. And you'll just be like... Bleh, bleh, bleh. You won't be, able to, won't be able to parse it. Your brain will fall apart. You'll cry, because you know you're about to die. I'm in, no, you don't. I'm in a weird frame of mind tonight. You can talk to the drunk guy? We were at school together. How, how about you buy me a drink? For, for old time's sake. I think I know this actor. All right, well, peace outside. Yeah, that's the best response. No, you don't. Look for someone. Nice. You know Frank Morgan? Tone, brother. Frank's your regular. He's a loner in the back. Everyone's smoking and drinking. Frank Morgan? See your married man. Who's ass? Well, you're a real sunshine, huh? LAPD. I understand you're a friend of Adrian Black. Yeah, I know him. Are you aware that he's missing? No, I hadn't heard that. Tough break. A lying piece of shit. You found Black's car abandoned in a freight depot, covered in blood. You know anything about that, Morgan? Hell no. Uh, I, I'm, I'm sorry to hear that. I like Adrian. He, he's a good oh, boss. Please, don't tell me you actually believe this jerk off, Phelps. You're lying, Morgan. You were there. And you're talking out your ass, detective. How about you prove I was out at that rail yard? What? That was weird. Uh, I don't think he was there. Um, aside from maybe the, the receipt for the hog that had his name on it? I would believe this game could go either way. Like, just his name being on it doesn't prove he was there. It just proves he bought the hog. So I really have nothing. I truly don't have any solid evidence, but this game could also just be like, blurp. Like I made a mistake. So I'll go to doubt. But it's in the abandoned vehicle. I could still see this game just being like, that's wrong. That's nothing, but I'll try it, man. I'll try it. Okay. We found a receipt in the trunk of the car. It has your name. That doesn't prove he was there. Whatever. I'm I'm figuring out this game's logic. That fool Adrian's fallen for some dame in Seattle. I knew that. Wanted me to make it look like he'd been attacked. Okay. Where exactly is Black hold up? No idea. I think he took off for Seattle. I mean, I think he's actually telling the truth there. How was he getting there? Oh, so that's the wrong one? I don't know. Maybe a Greyhound? You guys ought to go try the terminal on Sunset. So Adrian isn't hurt? What's with all the blood? I don't know. It was dark. Okay, that's the wrong sound. Nick on something. All right. 
Yeah. You're lying, Morgan. You killed Black and hid the body. Where is it? Me? Hey, all I did was help the fool. You're gonna need a lot more than that to prove that I heard him. The bloody pipe? So that's wrong? How about you guys go find another table? Okay? This doesn't add up, Morgan. Your excuses don't help. Let's see how you enjoy the LAPD taking an interest in your life. You want my opinion? We tell Morgan. I say he's lying. And whatever hole he's whatever, man. stashed in, he's gotta go back there sometime. He's gone! He went to Seattle! Real logic doesn't exist in this game. Yeah, I'm figuring that out. It's all right. I'm learning not to take it personally. Just rolling through it. Sure left his drink in a hurry. I bet he wishes he'd rehearsed that story better now. You skip the sequence if you get the questions right. Yeah. God, why did you just stop? Why did you just stop? God damn it. This game is in some bizarro version. You've got a pretty funny idea of what keeping a low profile means, Phelps. Out of L.A. Jesus. Fuck off. It is a nice car. <sighs> Maybe the studio closed because we weren't that good at making games. We? Did you work for them? Everyone has that reaction to driving this game? Yeah. It's all caps. What the fuck? It does kind of give the game its own weird, annoying charm. I like games that kind of have their own rules, and it's kind of like alternate reality stuff. Why is it blinking? What's happening? Oh, because that's too close. Tailing is not fun on a keyboard. I just have to like keep tapping W so I don't go too fast. This game's very much like Shenmue. I could see that. It's about human interactions, but the replication of those humans, it's like weird facsimile humans. Time and you're already tailing drunks home from bars. You having fun yet? I told you it was non stop glamour working traffic, didn't I? I'm just trying to learn. Oh, come on, Phelps. Save the creepy teacher's pet stuff for Leary. It won't work on me. Everyone's got these cool, like, loft apartments in this game. Oh, that is it. Okay. Game of Magic the whole way. It's it's unique. I guess yeah. In that way, I get I get comparisons to Shenmue. See if he's missed us yet. There are things you can say are kind of objectively wrong, but those things bizarrely contribute to its likability, provided you have the endurance to get through them. What the hell is that? Would you relax? Ah. Jesus, Adrian! I told you we're in the clear. I'll get it. They are fellow friends, oh, shit. gentle boys. It's over, Morgan. Mr. Black? LAPD! Give yourself up now! Oh boy. I knew it! Phelps, Let's go after him. I'll try and head him off in the car. But remember, Thank you, Bastin, for gifting five subs. No point running, Adrian. I'm gonna play a song for that in a minute. Fuck. Mr. 
Mr. Black, get back here right now. It's over, Adrian. Stop right there, Adrian. Why not just come clean with her, Black? Why the melodrama? I thought it would be easier. No, it just got a whole lot harder. Adrian Black, you're under arrest for conspiracy and fraud. We'll see what the DA has to say about wasting police resources on a wild goose chase like this. You're gonna lose your wife, lose your job, and probably end up in the big house. I hope she was worth it, Adrian. She? You're still on that? That turned out to be quite some case, huh? Adrian, what an idiot. <laughs> you got an arrest and a clearance in your first case, and in fine style, too. Well done, detective. I guess I am a hero. technique, good public presence. You keep that up and you learn from Bukowski here, you could go a long way in this department. I did it. I did it. I'm a good cop. I did it. Clean! Some tougher questioning. Whatever. Okay, so it's saving now. Four stars? I didn't even see the star rating. Alright. I'm gonna play I'm gonna play a song. And then I think that'll probably be the end of the stream. Cause it's getting late. I started late, so my fault. But at the same time, I got an early flight tomorrow. I'm doing some stuff. Some excitement. Hopefully I'll get to make a cool thing out of it. Oh, you're going to sleep, Grace? Well, that's fine. You have uh, you've done it at the perfect time because I'm playing a song and then I'm gonna shut it down. Let me see. I'm trying to remember what what this album is. Stream this weekend? Yeah, Sunday. I should be able to unless unless something comes up and something might come up, but. Should be able to. Not gonna be here Saturday though. All right, it's pretty generic electronica, but I'm always in the mood for that. So please enjoy the song. Alright, I think that'll do it for tonight. Just put it here so I can wish everyone a good night. We're heading up on the weekend. So that's exciting. See you guys next stream.
to get the code. まで泣くんじゃない名作保証マザーついに大歓声Okay, Cyberswine, these are your skill chip implants. They're mounted in your portable chip array and activated vocally. Let's have a look. He's just the thing this department's been after for a long time. You've seen the state this city streets are in. No, I don't think so. Oh, great.